So for the month of June, we have a display called Read with Pride in celebration of Pride Month. Um, just to celebrate all the landmarks and the fights uh, for LGBTQ rights. So we've pulled out uh, two significant court cases and one piece of legislation as part of the display. We have Egan and Canada from 1995 when the Supreme Court uh, held that sexual orientation was an analogous ground for the purposes of Section 15. In 1998, we had Green and Alberta where the Supreme Court held that sexual orientation had to be a prohibited ground of discrimination in provincial human rights codes. And then in 2005, we have the Civil Marriage Act that uh, legalized same-sex marriage in Canada. So a few of the uh, books in the display, uh, some of the highlights include Out and About, the LGBT Experience in the Legal Profession. This was published by the American Bar Association and it gives first-person accounts of LGBTQ lawyers, academics, and judges throughout the United States. There's Queer Mobilizations, Social Movement Activism, and Canadian Public Policy, which is edited by Manon Tremblay and published by UBC Press. And it's a collection of essays that focus uh, about activism at the national, regional, and even municipal levels. There's A Two-Spirit Journey by Mani Shakabi, who's an Ojibwa Cree elder. It goes from the 1950s to 2014. We have just out this year a three-volume encyclopedia called The Global Encyclopedia of Lesbian, Gay, Bisexual, Transgender, and Queer History. Uh, there's Never Going Back, which is a history of queer activism in Canada. Now, it was published in 2002, and it gives a history of the lesbian and gay liberation movement in Canada. We have Same-Sex Marriage, the Personal and the Political. It's by Queen's Law's own Kathy Leahy, as well as Kevin Anderson, and it was published soon after same-sex marriage was legalized. This book gives a history of how same-sex marriage was legalized in a number of countries, including Canada, and has interviews with couples who have since been able to marry.